Cherry Tree Holiday Park in Great Yarmouth is one of the best there is in the UK. So let's have a look around and get on with the video. I've stayed at virtually every Park Dean Resort site there is in East Anglia and I have to say that Cherry Tree is definitely one of the better parks. Very leafy, very green, very well kept as you can see. There are two outside play parks at Cherry Tree, one here for the smaller children and there's also a bigger park around the corner of the clubhouse entrance that suits the larger children with a climbing frame and various slides etc. Cherry Tree also benefits from an outdoor play area where children can play football or basketball, uh, whatever they like to, on the AstroTurf. Entertainment is every night in one form or another. There is an indoor swimming pool. Uh, Cherry Tree has a nice indoor pool where they have various activities that go on at certain times of the day. Some of them are free of charge and some of them you have to pay for, such as this one here. You need to book it in advance at reception and pay, I think, about £6 each for them to have a go. The outdoor area is great, nice place to go and sit and relax, get some sun and have a gin and tonic. When you come out of the pool, there's a play area here with a ball pool. There's also the obligatory arcade and the kids can gamble for tickets. You've also got some of the traditional games you might expect, such as air hockey, and here are the kids having a game of that. There's a bar stroke restaurant on site which serves food all day, opens from about nine in the morning and does breakfast, lunch, and dinner. Also has some minor entertainment in the evening, such as karaoke. We didn't see any while we were there, but they do do it apparently. You can get gin and tonic, beer, wine, etc. here. There's a fairly decent bar. The clubhouse is very big, gets much busier than this at times. Uh, this is a very quiet time, but it can get very packed. One night, all of those seats were pretty much taken. I'm not going to go into the accommodation too much because it varies significantly depending on your budget, uh, etc. So I'll leave you to investigate that yourself because there's no point in me reviewing something that's going to change so quickly. There's a shop next door to reception. It is quite expensive. And there's also a gym, but you do need to pay for a membership for this for your stay. It's not included in the price of your accommodation as standard. If you want to go shopping, there are two supermarkets nearby um, on the way to Great Yarmouth. One is a Tesco superstore, the other is an Asda superstore. There's a train station next door to the Asda supermarket, so you don't necessarily have to drive to Yarmouth. You could get the train and then a bus, and we did see people do that. In terms of things to do, Great Yarmouth's got the renowned Pleasure Beach, where they've got the wooden roller coaster and a water slide and all sorts of different rides. You can also go along the beach. There's lots of places to go and eat and drink. Uh, Sarah's Tea Room's quite good if you want a nice cup of coffee and something to eat. Various arcades, etc, etc, etc. The list goes on and on and on. Uh, there's a Sea Life Centre. There's Case to Car Collection. So there really is lots that you can do in Great Yarmouth. Anyway, would I go back to Cherry Tree? Yeah, absolutely, I would go back. It's definitely one of the best parks that Park Dean Resorts have uh, in East Anglia, and I would highly recommend it. Hope you enjoyed this very quick review. Hope you find it helpful. Enjoy your holiday, and see you soon.